It was an emotional time for Steve Holton. After being a two-pack-a-day smoker for 40 years, the diagnosis of lung cancer wasn't a shock, but it was certainly the last thing he wanted to hear. Making matters worse, the thought of a long, painful recovery after surgery to remove the cancer. With the old procedure, I think it was very common for the patient to be one or two days in the intensive care unit, then uh, a minimum of four or five days in the hospital. We used a couple of large tubes to drain the area that we operated on, and those usually came out about the fifth day, and the patient went home about the seventh or eighth day. But that's not the whole picture with this operation because patients would come back to the office complaining of pain in their chest for months and months and even years because of the spreading of the ribs and the removal of the rib. Everybody I talked to, their recovery times were much longer. I mean, even, even uh, well over a month into it. They're still taking heavy-duty pain medicine constantly and not getting enough relief from it. But Dr. Robbins had a silver lining for Steve's dark cloud. Because Steve's lung cancer was caught in the early stage, he was a prime candidate for an advanced surgical technique called thoroscopic lobectomy. We've done the operation, for instance, if we do it on Monday, the tubes come out on Tuesday and the patients go home on Wednesday and are back even doing heavy work by the next, within seven days. It's been a huge change for us. The new procedure differs in that instead of making a long incision to cut across muscle and spread or possibly break a patient's rib to get to the lung, a surgeon has to make only a small two to three inch incision and insert an illuminated rigid tube in order to get at the affected portion of the lung. It'll get you out of the hospital quickly and back to work quickly. It's every bit as effective as the old procedure with uh, many times less the trauma uh, to the patient. The quick recovery time also allowed Steve to get back into the swing of his favorite activity. I love golf. The first weekend, I just went over and ate breakfast. Uh, the second weekend, I did some putting, uh, chipping. And uh, this weekend here, uh, if things go well, I'm going to try to hit a couple of golf balls. It's changed his life, and it's changed all these patients' lives to be able to go back to work so quickly. I truly believe that every chest procedure will be done this way in 10 years. I think the old procedure will be a thing of the past. For Smart Medicine, I'm Rob Starnes.